Most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid. And the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town. And uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too. And uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific, a trackling atmosphere. The match, I think, will be quite a spectacle. This is, of course, the Camp Nou, one of the best known, perhaps the best known of all the venues in European football. Two high-profile, high-caliber teams. This is a welcome event for all these supporters. Yes, Peter, it's a shame it's only a, a friendly, but then again, that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest. And I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favour of, of lots of flair, skill and plenty of tricks and a few goals. I suspect I've probably overstretched my, my level of greed here. Got things on the way. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling end of it? Shot a goal! And he's there to make a great save. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Get to the keeper and try something new. Gerard. Good challenge. He just stood firm. And he's on his way! was physical, no nonsense, and it had to be. Can he finish? Good running with the ball, can they build on it? That's great defensive work, it doesn't take too much imagination to guess what would have happened otherwise. Well, he was thinking about headlines, I'm sure, but he ought to focus more on, on breaking lines. Lineker. Williams. So it is still nil-nil. Now it's Torres. He's one of and Torres! There it is! The breakthrough strike! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. A 1-0 lead established. Listen, when it comes to goals, Peter, in this team, he's always the number one contender and he's done it again. Some excellent tackling here and that one a perfect example. He's left his man. Oh, flags up. He must have been offside. Yeah, a defence that likes to play a, a high line, and they're not disappointed. Williams. Hardly anything between the sides. And the score is 1-0. Yeah, that's top defending in preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Williams. That's an untidy challenge. Free kick given. Well, the ref's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. Driving on now, what can they conjure from here? And he's shown him a clean pair. Gerard! This could he can pounce on that. They've done it! All too easy.
City. They are in danger of disappearing out of sight. He was really quick to react to the initial save, and he has his reward. Well, that's not the best attempt by the keeper, and he's just paid the ultimate price, hasn't he? So that's two now without reply. That second goal has such a, a polarising effect on prospective moves. I mean, one team are under... We reached half-time. Why don't you review the first half? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first-half success with a, another show of strength? It has been a remarkable contest, decorated by goals, and two between them at half-time. The second half gets underway. So both teams emerge the same as they were before the break. Rivaldo. It's Fernando Torres. Williams. It is a corner. Played it short, looking to go deep. Oh, that's a foul, and the whistle's gone. And he's going to have his name taken. Well, the protest continues, but in the end, they are defending the indefensible. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter, we've seen at one of those raking passes just to spread the play. He's off on a marauding run. Lampard! And that would have been some goal. Oh, what a skill set he has. He's just ghosted past a couple of defenders. Long and direct. A real chance to break. Oh, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Now then, what's happening here? He is already on a yellow. Just the talking to, I think. Yes, it is. Oh, Peter, what a lucky, lucky boy. A telling off as opposed to a sending off. He heaves it forward. Gets up to head it! He's done very well to get to that. Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper, has just received an A-plus grade. And they're not going to make any further progress now. It's a loose ball. He's got away. A chance to play it in. Lampard. Walk forward. What does he try from here? He's away! He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. 
Well, they could break here. And they certainly caught him there. It's a free kick. And no surprise, that's a booking. Well, sometimes a loose foul can trigger a completely different spell of play, and uh, it makes even less sense. He's been bundled over, that is a foul. Well, he's playing innocent, he has every reason to. Referee has gone straight to his pocket, yes, a second yellow, and he's off. He does seem to be in considerable discomfort, so we hope it's nothing serious. Well, there may be some scope for debate over the seriousness of the offence, but none over its repercussions. We'll have to see out the rest of the game with ten men. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal, then. Going for goal! <laughs> and it's been taken short. Up to meet it! Well, to get his head on that, but couldn't score. No, that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to, uh, to pick out. Rivaldo. Eto. Could have here their final chance. The final whistle. So they bask in their win, a genuinely professional performance and a result which is well-deserved. Your reflections then, Jim? Yeah, they had a game plan which was about hammering away in central positions and it paid off. For me, they were persistent and ruthless. And with that, it's time for me to thank Jim Beglin and to wish you a very good evening. <laughs>